time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. Where is it at? Right down there. Hit it and hit that little notification bell while you're at it. And it's time to follow my Instagram, Geekly Amanda, G-E-E-K-O-Y Amanda, same on Twitter. And it's time to get this movie review started. This past weekend, I had the chance to do a little screen of the new Disney Plus movie, Lady and the Tramp. Let me start off by saying I absolutely enjoyed it. I thought, number one, the scenery where they filmed it was perfect. It had that, I think it was in Savannah it was filmed. It had that total like old timey Savannah Southern feel. And it was perfect because it, it was like kind of set back in the day uh, where, you know, before all this modern technology, when Lady gets taken and all that, we know from the story when Lady gets taken, they didn't have cell phones out there. But like, where's Lady at? No, no, they had to search around for her all up in there. And, and find her without the technologies. They didn't have chips in their dogs. They didn't. So it was that old time feel, which I loved. I loved the costumes in it, the scenery. And oh, I loved the dogs. The dogs had me just melting. The Cocker Spaniel lady, the the kind of mutt dish for the tramp. They had, you know, a little, what the, the little Scotty dog and, and, the, and the beagle or the hound. No, the hound dog and all those. And they, they were so cute. I mean, they were talking through it and stuff. So there were some parts where you saw kind of this, their mouth moving and it looked a little, a little silly, but it's, the, I mean, it's fun. How else are you going to do it? It's, it's a, it's a lady in the tramp, a movie about dogs talking and, and, and enjoying and eating spaghetti together. Of course, it's just going to be fun and silly like that. The story, ah, oh, the story, y'all. I mean, we all know the, the story, right? Do you know? You know, ladies, the, the, the queen of the household, and and then you know she meets Tramp, and he he brings her to the the side of the no, that ain't all the story. But what I loved about it, it did follow a lot of the original story. It did, but I, what I even loved it brought a little extra something. It brought we saw more of like the backstory of Tramp, which oh that I cried. That had my heart just breaking. I cried. I uh, tears running down my face. I I I love that they did that. I mean, we kind of know Lady's backstory, but Tramp, he was just like a dog off the street, right? We didn't know much of his backstory, but but you see a lot of like what he went through, and you feel for him, and you're you kind you're rooting for Tramp. You're like Tramp, do the right thing. Tramp, do the right thing. The voices of it. Oh, I love it. who was it that Tessa Thomas did um, the voice of Lady, and I was not aware of this. But before, until I watched it and researched a little bit about movie, but Justin threw what is it? Justin Th Trudeau. I can never see his last name. Justin Trudeau. 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 Does the voice of Tramp? Is he still married to uh, Jennifer Aniston? He, she was. He was his her beau, Jennifer Aniston. But I, I always looked at him. I love the work that he's done. He did some of those series on HBO when. The people disappear and all that weird stuff happens and a lot of times I know I when I watch him I try to just look at it I, I look at him a little bit like the eye candy I do guilty I'm admitting it now but I really really saw like his acting chops or at least his voice acting chops you know voice and tramp I mean he pulled me in he pulled me in I I'm telling you he pulled me in so much tramp was like my favorite one when you think of Lady of Tramp what do you think of you think of the scene with the spaghetti and the meatballs and they're sharing a little candlelit dinner. Oh, they bring that back. So don't you be worried. Don't you be worried. They bring that back. Remember that part? And they slurped the little spaghetti together and did. I was waiting for that. It might not have been true, exact, moment for moment. But it was still sweet. Just like the book, just like, you know, the original movie and stuff. So it was a sweet little moment they brought back. And I'm glad they did. It wouldn't be a lady and a tramp for me unless they brought that back. Movies coming out on Disney Plus. One of the first movies drop in on Disney Plus when it comes out November 12th. And I can see why. Because it was a winner for me. A winner for me. The kids are going to love it. Um, and, you know, they're going to bring Disney Plus with a bang. And they're going to bring out their big shows. And Lady and the Tramp is one of them. You won't want to miss it. 
you want to not if not for everything else in Disney Plus I mean you're gonna want to get it for this and all the other stuff that I'm gonna be reviewing I have some screeners for that, that also so keep an eye out for more reviews on all the Disney Plus movie shows that will be coming and until next time you know what to do comment thumbs let me know what your thoughts on this and all that and until next time bye